Hello and welcome back friends. In today's episode we are going to learn how we can grow these cactus at our home. You can see they are going beautifully in these cups. So let's not make delay and let's learn how to grow this cactus at our home. This is a variety of cactus that is growing in my backyard. Okay now I'll show by steps by step how we can grow it. I have plucked a branch of the cactus okay similarly i will collect two three branches of the cactus okay. taking in my room and i'm that is a uh, cocoa peat in the cup and you just plant it in that cup as shown these branches are little bit dried up you can see the wrinkles in this cactus branch i'll show the updates later on you just you need to water very occasionally and this is another variety of cactus that is growing side of my window so i'll cut a branch of it and do the same process i'm going to plant that branch in this cocoa pit you need to be a little bit careful because it has very sharp thrones okay filling it with the cocoa peat and making it little bit rigid so that it will not move while during growing of roots otherwise the root will be damaged you need to water very occasionally in three to four days only checking the moisture level okay this is another variety of cactus and it is almost dead so I will uh, plant this, replant this cactus in another in the same way. Okay, I have taken a branch of the cactus. Similarly, I will collect another branch. Now, planting this branch in this cocoa peat. Generally, I use a cocoa peat because it is the best starter for any plants or seeds this is the same plant i have planted around 50 days back in my cup and now after 17 days it has given me a very well green signal that it is growing generally an adult branch grows faster than a younger branch after 50 days you can see that plant that cactus plant has grown very well in this cup and you can see how this cactus roots has grown over a period of time it has grown in 40 days okay you can see i'm separating each plant each branch you can see that the roots are very uh, thick they have completely absorbed that cocoa peat Generally the root has fibers that's why these fibers make the cocoa peat stick on it and the cocoa peat is not getting separated from the roots. Similarly the other plants you can see these white roots they are basically at the side of the cup that's why they could not absorb any cocoa peat. You can see a hard thick root of this cactus growing very well it is uh, showing a good growth in this cup. My next video will be on how to grow cashew nut plant at home. So if you want to know that too, please keep following my channel. I hope you like my video. Please give a thumbs up and please do subscribe for more interesting videos. Thank you and see you again.